Nathan. Congratulations, man. <clears throat> it happened. Yeah, the 500. And it really happened, man. Congratulations. <clears throat> so, um, yeah. Nathan, you are truly one of the um, larger-than-life figures here in the uh, vinyl community. And in that sense, you embody truly in the body, mind, and soul, from my perspective, <clears throat> the heart and soul of what the vinyl community is about and can be about. And I do say can be because, again, the vinyl community is so much larger than any one of us. But <clears throat> Nathan, your um, generous, loving spirit, your true sense of familia in a very, very global type of way, the way you express that is very heartwarming. Um, you indeed are a bold man. And I salute you because you are, you are naked in front of the camera with who you are. And um, it just, to me, just is such, such an, such, it's really something to respect and honor in when I see it in other people and something I, as you know, I try to embrace. Nathan, you know, the part of the country where you're at truly is blessed with your presence. And um, I, I, I know that the 500 subscribers means a lot to you. I remember you speaking about it before and wondering, would it happen? And so two thumbs up. And, um, you know, I, 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 I started to think about how I would answer the uh, main question by showing a record, and then I stopped thinking. And that's when the answer came to me. Because that, again, is an, an, act, an act, or really a non-act, in direct correlation to who you are. You just let things happen, be in the moment, life. The incense thing, even though uh, I won't uh, give anything away, I'm not sure, but again, I believe I do understand. And so, when I, when I just allowed the record to show itself to me, that in many ways, I think truly expresses who I think see you as. And I think I really see a lot of you, even though I've never met you. Uh, I do study people, even though people don't really want to be studied. I'm studying your asses anyway. <laughs> it's a beautiful day. That's you, Nathan. The front back, the inside and out. In many ways, I would say that I, if I needed to go through every song of this album and, and play it and relive it to explain why I think the entire album can be an experience, an experience expression of you, I could do it. But the main what you get from when you see this, the words, it's a beautiful day. This is what you're about, Nathan. You know, it's wonderful because as a total human being, we, we see all sides of you. The up, the down, the sweet, the sour, the angry, the elated, the joyful. And ultimately, it always comes back to, it's a beautiful day. Your center, You're, you have a center about you that I sense and that you show. 
And could it be fake? Mm, well, yeah, we everybody can fake, but do I think Nathan Morales is anything fake about Nathan? Are you kidding me? Absolutely not. It's like your uh, your personality is like glue that binds. Communities need you. You are an archetype as well as just a guy. You are the type of person that communities need because you bring people together. That's a purpose about you that I sense. If you had, um, <clears throat> I don't know exactly what you do for a job. I haven't quite sussed it. I think you've talked about it. I, I forget. But I think in my mind, your cosmic job or your life job would be one who is a gatherer of people and one who works to not some, you know, you could say on the one hand that your job would be to keep peace among people, but really the job is to bring a cord to help this happen with people. And I don't mean to be pretentious with all this talk. I'm serious that this is you asking, what do people think of you? And this is a people, this is Derek, and this is my opinion, honestly, of you, Nathan. Um, and It's a Beautiful Day is, I think, a perfect representation of a big part of your personality. Do I see that you are a total person with a dark side? Well, there we have it on the inside cover as the sun goes down. And we have the group of individuals who come together to play this music, standing at a gr as a group and yet apart, each left to stand on his own. We have those different parts of the personality, you know. Not everyone is sunshine and, and baked cookies, you know, and not everyone is darkness and hell. Every single one of us has all that in us, and you are one of those. And this album represents the fact of that. But notice the overall message, the overall image here, the bird in flight, and the words of this song, White Bird, she will fly or she will die. White Bird must fly or she will die. Nathan, your spirit must be free. You, you must be free. You must be honest. You must express yourself. I admire the fact that you, sh you shamelessly speak about what you need and ask for what you need and call attention upon yourself because that's the truth of each person we all I remember when I got flack about it early on in the vinyl community I wonder what happened to that guy he's been gone for a long time vinyl disorder about being honest about saying that people want attention and that we need it I admire that you are in, in many ways, very centered about how you just speak very honestly about, well, I want to know you. And part of knowing you is, uh, I want to, I'd like to see your reflection of me, you know, and I'm calling attention to me. I want you to come and rally around me. I want you to be with me, you know. You, you, you do that um, very boldly, but very lovingly. And, uh, you know, I could go on. And I'm seeing that it's, I'm about to hit the 10 minute mark and I'm going to stop because I don't want to. I want this to be seen comfortably by people. Nathan, congratulations on 500, 1,000 coming up, eh? It's just a matter of time. You are such a beautiful soul. Such a beautiful soul. Thank you so much for being alive.